Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to show you one trick to pass MSET 2020, either it may be APM set or TSM set. So, before starting with the video, if you are new to this channel, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon. So, this trick is based on survey of the previous year papers. So these tricks you should have to use at the last moment of the examination after attempting some of the questions which can easily solve by you. Now let's move towards the trick. So after doing the previous year paper survey, I had got to know that out of 160 questions, the options with answer A will be 40 and answer B will be 40 and answer C will be 40 and answer D will be 40. So it may change a little bit. Sometimes they mass 44 questions of answer A and 36 questions of answer B. So it may vary a little bit. So we will consider by using this trick that all the options A, B, C, D have equal answers 40. That means each option has 40 answers. A contains 40, B contains 40 and C contains 40 and D contains 40. Not only the average student, the, the topper can also use this trick. At the last moment of the examination, you should have to do the cross check that you have answer 40 questions of answer A and 40 questions of answer B and 40 questions of answer C and 40 questions of answer D. So by this, you can easily check the probability of the answers to be correct which were attempted by you. So now, we will see in the detail. So suppose you have answered 20 questions of answer A then remaining options are 20 that should have the option A by this trick. So you should have to answer remaining 20 questions as option A. You should have to do tally at the last moment of the examination of the answer attempted by you and the options should be. So suppose you have answered 25 questions of answer B and the remaining options are that 15 that should have option B. So you should have to answer remaining 15 as B. So now we'll go towards the option C. Suppose you have answered 30 questions of the option C, then the remaining questions that should have option C are 10. So by using the guess trick, you should have to answer remaining 10 questions as option C. So suppose you have answered 33 questions of the answer D, then the remaining options that should have answer D are 7. So you should have to answer remaining 7 questions as answer D. So first start with the options which are less you have answered. For example, you have answered option A as 30 questions and option B as 25 questions and option C as 15 question and option D has 3 questions. So first start with the option D which you have answer less. So then go to the option C and option B and option A. So by using this trick you can easily get pass in the MSET 2020. Not only getting the pass you can easily score good marks in MSET by using this trick. For more tips and tricks regarding the MSET 2020 join our WhatsApp group. The link is available in the description where you can find fast and latest update regarding the MSET 2020. So share this informative video with your friends and family members who are going to write MSET 2020. So if you like this video make sure to hit the like button and if you are new to this channel make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon.